Let's do these goddess braids, but get into this hang time. My hair has grown so much. Anyway, so I pre-parted my hair and sectioned it off and did little rubber bands to keep those sections intact. Let's part out these baby hairs. I ain't trying to lose them. So I am doing traditional box braids. I'm not doing knotless braids. I haven't perfected that yet on myself. So I'm doing what I know how to do and that's the traditional braids. So get into that. Just braiding my hair down until I get to a point where I want to add in the human hair. And this is it. I'm just taking that, um, stretching out a little bit and adding that into the hair to braid. Once that piece is added in, I just clip it out of the way so that it doesn't get braided into the rest of the braid. Then I grab some more of the human hair to add to the end of the braid. And this is me just stretching out the hair a little bit so that it can be kind of tapered and easier to braid and not super blunt, if that makes sense. So I'm just braiding it down to a certain point and you'll see that I have some straight pieces, which I'm fine with because I want it to look natural. And I'm just using some of the synthetic hair to wrap around it and tie it in a knot. And that's it, it secures the braid. Something about braiding my hair makes me want to watch Moesha. So that's always playing in the background when I braid. So this is the next day. We continue the braiding process. It usually takes me anywhere from five to six hours to braid my hair, just depends. And this is me using a little bit of edge control on my braids to just kind of slick everything down. Just give it a neat look. And look y'all, this is the final braid. I was so happy. Um, several hours later and we are done. The biggest flex is knowing how to braid your own hair. I love that for me. Now going in with this mousse to slick and smooth everything down. It's just the final touch on your braids. It gives it an extra shine. And then I'm adding some of this Canvas Beauty um, hair growth serum to my parts and my braids. I always add it to my edges. And that's it. Let me know what you think.